Hi everybody, Cynthia here. Um, I'm just going to share with you two layouts that I, I made. Um, I used a combination of the Tim Coffee uh, Cane Company Beach Theme Paper and the Buy the Sea Collection from Graphic 45. And a lot of the one sheet of paper had a lot of seashells um, on the Cane Company, so I ended up cutting them all out so I can use them on my layouts. And I also used some of this, um, let me get it out, some of this fish netting. And you can pick this up at Michael's where they sell the bags of seashells and stuff. But I love to cut this apart and put it on my beach themed layout. And let me show you the first, the first one's just a single one and the next one's a double. Um, this one I used the pretty seashell paper from Graphic 45 and then on the back of it, as you can see, I just flipped it around and made two photo mats. And then I did all the corners up and then I used um, my enamel dots to make like pearl trim. And then in all the corners here, I actually used flat back pearls. But the layout's called At the Beach. and. See if you can see the postage stamp I cut out with the fish and did some netting there. And then I have some doily, uh, doily behind this photo mat. And it says, Castles of the Sand, Memories of Gold. And I have some seashell stickers. Some are dimensional. Some anchor wood veneers, the postage stamps. I have a sailboat wood veneer and some more of the fish netting on this side. And then in the corner down here, I used one of the cutouts to make a journal spot and add a dimensional starfish, some more fish netting. There's a doily behind here, but I pretty much covered that up. Another wood veneer anchor, and I love this beach chair, this lounge chair, and it has a hat on it. I just think that's so cute. Um, this sticker and like the seashells on this page, I got those in a pack at the Dollar Tree, so I don't know if that helps, uh, quite a while ago. And then I have more fish netting down here, another postage stamp, and the two photo mats are 6x4. So that's the first layout that I completed. And the next one is a double um, layout. I'll try and put it side by side and then lift my camera so maybe you guys could could make it out show you both at one time and then I'll show you single so close your eyes if you get dizzy but this is what they look like together and I used K and Company as my base paper and then let me set the camera back down close your eyes guys I don't want to make you dizzy here okay so the first layout I have three photo mats on and they all measure four by six and then I made this pocket here and tucked in like a journal tag and that says the sea once it's cat it cast its spell holds one in its net of wonder forever and the title of my page is by thee and then the other one has um, ocean and these I used aren't these cute these banner wood pieces or chipboard pieces um, these came from like a thickers sticker pack Let's see if I can lift my camera so you guys can see them and then I used some twine and, and just tied it in with that did some fish netting over here adjust my camera again because I'm kind of bumping it all around and then for every photo mat I did a border of like a, a scallop punch and then these two the blue and the green with the white dots those are washi tapes that I used as my borders and then I have a fish I popped up on pop dots here kind of tucked it behind and then I have another seashell and some more of that netting um, in the center I have another seashell and netting and then down here in the corner I fussy cut these seashells from the paper 
and I glittered them up a little bit and the glitter doesn't rub off, it's the glitter glue. And then I just have a little bit of fish netting tucked in there, another seashell. So all the photo mats have these borders on them. So that's the first side and then the second side pretty much did the same thing with, here's the ocean theme. And um, more of the fish and netting, tucked the seashell behind here and I do have some of them on pop dots for dimension. And then these two are tucked behind that photo mat. And then down here I just did a bunch of seashells and a fish coming out. That's actually on the paper. Have another little fish tucked behind the photo mat there and then just more netting and and seashells through the whole thing and some fish netting over here. So I had fun making these. I still have a few more big um, sheets that I'm going to work on some more um, layouts and these along with my mini album are in my store. I will post the link below if you'd like to check them out. If you have any questions let me know and thank you guys so much for watching. Take care.